Hi everyone, welcome to Hunter Gatherer Cooking. I'm with Simon from Harkilla again and we're at the Stalking Show in Stafford. Uh, we're going to talk through some of the new items that are going to become available later in 2022. So over to Simon. Hello there, I'm Simon, I'm from Harkila. This is a lovely venue for a, uh, a good show. This is the, the stalking show. It's been very busy uh, this morning and up to lunchtime. We've got a bit of a lull now, so I'm gonna to talk to you about some of the new products we're doing. This one has been fantastically successful. This is the new Harkila Bino case. Comes in a nice, this is a load in green and there's a camo version as well, but now we're gonna talk about the green version. This opens up and sticks down here with a magnet, so if it's windy, it doesn't blow about. You've got plenty of room in here for binoculars. There's a removable cushion that comes out. So if you've got larger, maybe 10 by 50 binos, they fit in here and they will still enclose that. A magnet closes it and they still remain completely um, covered so you don't get rain on the uh, on the glass. Behind here you've got a phone pocket so you can fit your even a big phone like mine fit that in and close that and so that any rain would run off the back and not into your phone. There are obviously two pouches at the side these are held on with a molly system if you look hard in there you can see that there's a, uh, a stud that undoes and this can come off so you don't have to have these two but this is designed to take anything you've got so maybe a thermal device so a, a, a thermal spotter would easily fit in there we do some work with uh, the people at Pulsar so a Helion X38 or 50 which are the very good deer stalking ones would easily fit in there I've got a Leica Kalanox and that also fits in there. It, it takes virtually all of them, I'm sure. If you've got a range finder, you could maybe put that in the other one. It's really, really useful bit of kit, but these come off as well. The great thing about this is that they've not forgotten the harness as well. You can see that there's a proper harness. Um, this is adjustable. This model is quite skinny, unlike me. And uh, so there's a probably perfect adjustment for me and for him. Uh, if you're having a look there this is a really robust piece of kit really strong and the good thing is the straps are not elasticated because otherwise it bounces around when you walk and I know I've tried an elastic one and it tends to do this um, so this one doesn't do that you can actually adjust it up quite tight underneath you've got this molly system as well so you can buy all sorts of pouches etc to go on the molly system as that's a, a military thing you can buy loads of accessories that just fit on here and um, all in all this is a really great piece of kit uh, it's 99 pounds and this has actually just become available it's just on the market now so from today easily you'll be able to buy this as long as we don't run out of stock like one or two of the retailers here have done already they've bought enough for the two days they've sold all their stock of these in a day so it's going very well this is really, really nice. We're going to sell a hell of a lot of these. This is the new Pro Hunter Move jacket. The old jacket was very popular in the UK, but it had a slightly unusual zip and a pouch. Um, this wasn't completely popular in Scandinavia, even though it was a very good seller for this, for us. But this is a superb jacket. Very clean, very straight lines. It has a a Gore-Tex spider liner and you can see why it's called a spider liner it looks a bit like a, a cobweb and there's an internal pocket in here for putting your bits and pieces in phone pocket there on the outside has large zipped pockets and above those pit zips so you can on a wet day you can wear the jacket but if it's warm and wet, you can let some steam out because you're going to be hot walking around in this otherwise. And that's on both sides. Really good hood, which is three-way adjustable. And you've got a very, very nice, quite a strong wire peak so it doesn't flop down in front of your face. The hood is designed to be worn with a cap, particularly a waterproof cap. So this will not 
go further than the cap. The cap will poke out underneath that. Some hoods are very big and they're like Bo Peep, they come down in front of your face. Obviously if you're shooting that's a really bad idea. So this is designed to be slightly shorter and just fit over to the, to the front of your head. The outer material that we've used on this is the same that we use on all our Pro Hunter jackets. It's from the same um, manufacturer, it's a Swedish manufacturer that is known for making absolutely superb performance products. This is something that's incredibly durable, but the great thing about this is it's quite quiet. You probably can't hear nothing from this because it's so noisy in this, ho in this hotel, in this exhibition hall, but this is quiet as well. The lining, I don't know whether you can see this adequately, but that is just the lining. It's not bonded to the outside. Um, if quite often the bond and the lining, the waterproof lining, are bonded together, but that makes it sound quite flannelly. And when you're not in an exhibition hall, when you're outside in the woods, you really need to be as quiet as you can. So this is an extremely quiet system. Works very well. In fact, we're so confident that the durability of this fabric like all Pro Hunter goods, we give you a five-year warranty with that. So should this be damaged through um, no fault of your own, through a manufacturing fault or anything like that, we'll replace or repair the jacket um, as best we can. And uh, this is something that we do quite regularly. We have a look at things. If we can repair, we will try to. But this is a tremendously strong um, the fabric. It really is. Okay, another new product for the winter that we're very proud of is this range of Mezzo jumpers. This uses a uh, merino wool and a, uh, it has a tech wool finish. It's, it's um, a, a, an advanced system that helps to reduce the pilling on wool. Many wool garments, they pill, you get little bobbles on. This reduces this, it makes it stronger. You can see that this has got a, a knitted uh, appearance on the outside but actually on the inside, it's very fleecy. It's really warm, but really thin. And that's the great thing about this, is that it's giving you the best of both worlds. It's light and thin, but warm. Also very breathable, because it's completely natural. It's all wool, and then it's all a merino wool, so you'll be able to wash it without it suddenly being three sizes too small in the end. We've done the half zip with a good pocket in the front. I love this pocket. There's like a kangaroo pouch that goes through it. I can carry a lot of kit in that. They come in two colours. That's the, this is a full zip version, but it comes in the half zip as well. So that's the half zip. That's the full zip in the green. We've also done a ladies in this. There's a really nice grey and there's a green as well. Huge thanks to Simon for doing that. Um, so uh, the Bino pouch is already out. Uh, that came out, I think, in March. But the, uh, the other two pieces are going to be available, I think, from July. So you'll need to check on the website, which will be in the description below. But Harkila, I personally think, is an amazing product, amazing brand. They're doing some great things. We're having a great time here at the Stalking Show. If you are interested in that, then have a little look. I'll pop the description in the link below again. Uh, but I hope you're having a great time. Please hit that subscribe button. And if you've got any questions, um, I can get hold of Simon um, or any of the team at Harkilla and answer some of those technical questions. But again, keep subscribing and I'll see you soon.